Hi, Brent Tech here. Where tech is made simple. Last year in July of 2022, Mozilla started testing a new quick actions feature in their nightly preview version of Firefox. Now, over the last year, quick actions has made its way now down finally into the beta version, which is currently on version 116. And recently, as I posted, Mozilla updated the stable version of Firefox to version 115. And I'll leave a link down below to that video. Now, although Firefox 116 includes the new default quick actions feature, it's not available as yet in the stable version of Firefox version 115. But in case you're unaware, quick actions basically act as shortcuts to various options that are available in the browser, which you can access using your keyboard. Now, although it's not available in the stable version, if we head over to Chrome, just to give you an example, and in the search, we enter settings. Here is the Manage Settings Quick Action. So that's what the Quick Action is all about. You click on that and then it takes you directly uh, into the settings and just acts as a quick shortcut as mentioned. Now, although it's not available in the stable version of Firefox, which is currently as mentioned on version 115, um, it's still in preview in 116, um, we can enable Firefox Quick Actions in the stable channel. Because as an example, maybe you want to just try out the feature before it becomes available or you want to get early access. So just a quick video to show you how you can actually enable Firefox Quick Actions in the stable version, which is currently on version 115. Now to do this, um, just head to a new tab in the browser. And then as always, we have to head over to About Config, which we do by heading to the address bar, typing in About colon config so that's about colon config and because we are dealing with experimental features just accept the risk and continue so just take note of that now there are two flags we need to enable and both of them are quite a mouthful so what i'll do is i'll leave both of these down below in the description for you to copy and paste for easy access and reference so the first we're going to copy and paste that in and just take note that now you'll see the browser displays the preference with the actual boolean highlighted and now what we need to do is we need to navigate to the right hand side to the add button to actually add that flag so we click on that and there we go the flag has been added now and just leave it at the default value of true then the next flag we need to enable as mentioned i'll leave both of these down below for you to copy and paste come back in the search and we just paste that next flag in. There we go. Once again, there's the highlighted Boolean. We head over to the right hand side. We click on add and there we go. Just leave it at the default value of true. Now, just on a side note, if you want to at any stage um, later on, if you want to put everything back to default, what you can do is we can delete both of these flags by repeating the process and coming back and just for each of the flags, we just click on the delete button and that will actually delete the flag and put everything back to default so that's just on a side note now getting back to applying these flags now once you've added these two flags what we need to do now is we need to restart firefox to apply both of those flags and now you'll see if we head back to the address bar as an example i'm just going to type in manage but one thing to take note of is before we type in in the stable version something that's a little bit different uh, between the stable version uh, with this quick actions feature and the preview version 116 is that the stable version requires you to add a greater than sign before you type in the quick action so just take note of that um, in the stable version add a greater than sign before the relevant quick action so you enter a greater than sign a space and there we go there's all our different quick actions so as you can see, you can view add-ons, manage bookmarks, clear history, view downloads. You get the idea. There's all the quick actions that are available. And just to narrow this down, I'm going to type in manage. And there we go. And I'm going to click on manage bookmarks. And that takes me now over to my bookmark manager just to show you as a brief example. Now, just to give you another um, example, just for the purpose of today's video, I'm going to type in, first of all, just take note. In the stable version, we need to enter the greater than sign, space, and then you type in, for this example, I'm going to type in clear. 
and there we go clear history and then obviously you click on that quick action and it takes you directly over to the clear all history um, menu buried um, in the actual browser so and um, that's how you can enable quick actions that now are available in beta but as mentioned you can enable those now in the stable version 115 until they do become officially available and if you want a list of all the different quick actions that are available i'll leave those also down in the description for you just to have easy access and reference so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one